Hi, I'm Lou, another episode of My Car Story. We're in Rosemont, Illinois, at the World of Wheels. Come on out, great car show. If you love cars, you're gonna love this car show. I'm here with Buick Bob Starzak. Buick Bob, how are you today? Good. I've done some of your other cars before. Right. And let me grab the camera, let me ask you a couple of simple questions. How many Buicks has Buick Bob had? 17. 17, and why this Buick? What, this is number 17, why this Buick? It came up at an auction one day and it was uh, very dirty and nobody was looking at it and I was able to steal it. You couldn't help yourself. All right, come on back. And here's why he couldn't help himself. Take a look at that. Bob, what do we have here? What year? It's a 1960 Buick Electric 225 with 63,000 original miles on it and a total frame off paint job on it. 63,000 miles. And the Electra's the top of the line, correct? The Electra 225 saws for 225 inches long. And really? That's why they call it the 225. I didn't know that. All right, let's take a look at it from the side. This is one, as you just said, long automobile. Come on back with me, Bob. And the hardest thing about this car, I've trailered it up here. Yeah. And it's 80 inches wide, and the trailer doors are only 85 inches. So I only have five inches of gift space to get the car in the trailer. Really? That's amazing. Boy, somebody did great work on this car, too. This is just tremendous. Now, I'm a, th there's other models of this car, right? Because it usually doesn't have this trim across the bottom. The top line Electra 225s had the stainless steel trim that they had on the cars back in the 60s. So, and, and look at the windshield. It's got that nice, beautiful wrap around, and we've obviously got the convertible top. Tell me now, what's the color of this car? It's cream. 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 Uh, All right. Caribbean cream. Caribbean cream. Or casino cream. Casino cream. Casino cream. And again, you've just gotten the car, so we're going to give you a pass on that one. Take a look at those wonderful fins. They were toned down 1959. They had larger fins. And they were higher, they toned them down in 60, but they still had basically the same type of shape that they had in 59. Wow. Wow, wow, wow. There's your Electra 225 right there. And your Buick. Let's uh, let's open the door, please. Let's take okay. a look. Yeah, sure. This is what they called the Buick Club, uh, the Buick, they called this red. Red, okay. But it's actually, a, it looks more of a burgundy color. Yeah, I agree. Look at this. Wonderful, wonderful, wonderful. Tell me about that. Uh... And the air conditioning unit was put in on the car from the dealer. It's not a factory unit, but this is like a dealer one that was put in there. The car had air conditioning when it came out of the, the dealer itself. A dealer installed option. Right. And that has what they call the magnetic uh, mirrored uh, speedometer. There's a rolling thing to where you go up and down for your convenience and to stop the glare sometimes. It rolls up and down. Let me show and, you. and that's a cure. Right here, there's a thing. Oh, the dial's over here. This will move up and down. Oh, yeah. There's a mirror on there, and it shows you the different ways of doing it for your convenience, the way you want it. That's pretty cool. It's 100% original interior, different carpeting, but the car is uh, one of the rare ones. Great. Very few of these are left. Really, really fun car. That we're looking at here. This is this is a definite fat cat car. I mean, when you're driving this, you got to be feeling great. Oh, yeah. can't wait to drive it this summer. Yeah, exactly. Drop the top. Let's take a look under the hood. And there's your aftermarket air you were talking about. Right. And it, it was changed over to upgrade it to an alternator instead of having a generator okay. in there. And uh, they changed the alternator where this was because this is larger than what the unit was before. 
the best of graffiti that they had back in 1964 and finished it on the cars. Okay. Let's take a look. Uh, can we start it? Wildcat 445. All right. We're working on that. Note. A little open right now. Yeah, the choke is going to be a jump. We'll, we'll adjust. We'll just foul that out. We'll adjust the choke and get that straightened out, but it still sounds pretty good. Very good running card. Yeah. Well, let's shut the uh, shutter off. Shut the hood and come on out, back out. Let me just see something. What does it say on that? Is it the firing order right there? No, I don't know. It's the number right there. I'm yeah, firing sure order. Right up here. Oh, up on here. Yeah. It's the firing order up there. Yeah, I thought you thought the numbers down there. It's the block number. Block number. Oh, yeah. I can see those both there. All right. Let's uh, shut that hood. Well, Buick Bob, you are styling in this ride. Thanks for being on my car story. Thank you again.